Hi everyone, it's Teresa back with Craving Crochet. Let me show you something. Hey everyone, thank you so much for joining me today. Um, it's Teresa with Craving Crochet. And I'm going to be doing a 2K giveaway. Yay! 2K, 2K. I haven't reached 2K yet, but I'm on my way. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. So the this 2K video is all going to be based on the number 2K. And I will explain to you. So I need to get 2,000 subscribers, which I'm almost there. Last time I checked, uh, I don't know if I need maybe almost another 100 or under another 100, uh, under 100 to get to 2K. But I'm getting there. I'm getting there really close. So I want to say thank you to all my subscribers for um, subscribing and coming and joining me on this on this little crochet channel. Um, I'm excited for all the people I'm meeting and inspiring and sharing the craft that, of crochet that we all love so much. So I just want to say thank you for that. But I'm also, this is also, this whole giveaway is pretty much, yeah, maybe I'm going to call it um, sharing is caring or something like that. Because the way you enter this giveaway, you're going to have to share this video. That's how you're going to enter it. So anyways, let me just make a few, I just made some notes. So you must be at least 18, you have to be 18 or older to enter this. Um, I'm going to be the sole provider of this giveaway. I'm not working with a company. A company is not sponsoring it or anything. It's all coming out of my own personal funds to, um, to make this giveaway happen. For all the prizes, I'm going to be giving away four prizes. Um, and then how you enter is you have to share the video. Anyways, before I do that, before I give you all that, let me just tell you the other half of this. So it's, we have two goals that we have to reach and they're two, they're both, they have to have 2K in them. Okay. So I have a beautiful friend, a YouTube, uh, follower and friend. She's very dear to me. Um, I met her on YouTube and she is an amazing woman of God. She loves the Lord. She has a beautiful family, but she is having some struggles in her marriage. So I'm with this giveaway. The whole premise of this giveaway is, okay, yeah, I want to get my 2K, but I also want to raise money for this beautiful woman who is going through so many hardships. Um, I have, um, uh, um, a testimonial that I'm going to put in here somewhere of her speaking and talking about her um, domestic violence that she is enduring and has been enduring for many, many years. She's got a pretty large family and her kids have been affected by it. So it's really, really hard. She's, she's a single mom now and she's raising these kids all on her own. Um, she had to get out of her home because of the violence and of the abuse. And so she's, she got a home. Thank God she needs, but she still needs things. She's all, all on her own. You know, she doesn't have any parents Her parents are not in this world anymore. She has very limited, um, family that can help her. So she really, I'm really relying on my subscribers and everyone out there to help me raise some money. So it's 2k, $2,000 for this beautiful lady that I want to raise. Once we hit the 2K for me and the 2K for her, that's when I'm gonna do the giveaway. So I really, really am encouraging people to please, please share, share this video to get the word out. And if we hit a lot of people, we can easily get to 2K. So to 2K, I'm, I set up a GoFundMe. Um, and because I'm in Canada, she's in the US. so. Um, I think I put it up to 5,000, but because I'm going to be giving her Canadian money. So, um, for her to get 2k, it's got to be at least 3k Canadian or, or so. I can't remember if I put 3k or 5k, but you know what? If we go over our goal, 
awesome. So I'm saying I'm thinking maybe 2.5k to make it or 3k in for in order for it to be American money, right? Because uh, American money is worth a lot more than Canadian money. So so let's let's go for at least 3k. If we could do more. That's great. But I would really really appreciate all your help to, to help this poor woman. So I'm gonna leave her um her video here. It's not a video. It's a it's a record a recording of her voice because she's laying low. Um, but let me just give you some myths and facts about domestic violence quickly. Uh, so a myth is domestic violence happens only in low income families, and that's not true. That's a that's a myth. The fact is that domestic violence happens in all kinds of families, rich and poor, urban, suburban, and rural, and in every part of the country or and in every uh, racial, religious, and age group. Myth. Alcohol and drugs cause domestic abuse. That's a myth. The fact is, alcohol and drugs do not cause domestic violence. Domestic violence is a choice. Many abusers will make sure that they have alcohol or drugs on hand in order to use them as an excuse for their actions. Abusers will also claim their actions resulted because they could not have the alcohol or drugs. Myth. Domestic violence is an anger control issue. Fact. Domestic violence has nothing to do with anger. Anger is a tool abusers use to get what they want. We know abusers are actually very much in control because they can stop when someone knocks at the door or the phone rings. They often direct punches and kicks in parts of the body where the the bruises where the bruises are less likely to show, and they are not abusing everyone who makes them angry, but waits until there are no witnesses and abusers and abuses the one he says he loves. Myth: Abusers and or victims have low self-esteem. That's a myth. Abusers do not have low self-esteem. They believe they are entitled to have power and control over their partner. Abusers will pretend to have low self-esteem if it will make others believe that violence is not their fault. See, fact, survivors of abuse may have had great self-esteem at the beginning of the relationship, but the abuser uses emotional abuse, calling her names, putting her down, telling her it's all her fault in order to destroy her self-esteem some abusers look for women with low self-esteem as they believe she will be more likely to blame herself and less likely to report her behavior. Other abusers will seek women with high self-esteem as they may represent a, a greater challenge to control over time. Uh, myth. Domestic violence happens only once or twice in a relationship. Fact. Abusers usually escalate violent behaviors in frequency and intensity over time. So it starts out slowly. And then it gets worse and worse and worse over time. Myth. Some women want to be beaten. They ask for it. They deserve it. Some women go from abuser to abuser. It must be something about them. Oh, my gosh. Uh, fact. No one deserves to be abused. Everyone has the right to live free of violence. No one would want to have their partner be abusive. Women who find that their second or third partner are Abusers will often be blamed by others for the violence. It must be something about her or she will uses this information to blame her for the violence. See, it must be something that you are doing wrong. Or there would be there would not have been two of us or to silence her. You are not going to tell anyone because if you do, they will never believe you because you said that before. Such manipulation. Myth. Children aren't aware of the violence in their home. Fact. Studies show that most children are aware of the violence directed at their mother. Um, myth. Children are not at any risk of being hurt or injured. Fact. Men who abuse their partners are more likely to abuse the children in the home. Domestic violence is the number one predictor for child abuse. Subjecting children to an environment full of violent actions and hateful words is not being a good dad. Myth. Boys who witness violence will grow up to be abusers. Fact. Study have found that 30% of male children witness, witnesses choose to become abusers as adults. This means the 70% do not become abusers and are committed to ending the cycle of violence in their lives. 
The majority of children, male and female, who witness domestic violence become advocates for children when they grow up, committed to raising their children without the use of violence and going into professions where they work to end violence against children. Young men in our society must never feel that they are destined to become violent. We send a dangerous message to young men and boys when we imply they are fated to become violent and we give abusers an excuse for their behavior. A few more facts is domestic violence is a crime. It is against the law for anyone to physically harm or harass another person. In Oregon, the law says people shall arrest a person who they have reason to believe has abused another person. So this this website must be from Oregon. I don't know. Um, I just found it online. Domestic violence may lead to murder. That's a scary thought. Three quarters of all women who are murdered are murdered by their husbands, ex-husbands or domestic partners or domestic partners. In our community, nine women and children were, were murdered between 1999 and February of 2003. That's awful. Fact, domestic violence costs the U.S. economy an estimated three to five billion annually in job absenteeism and another 100 million annually in medical expenses. So it's it's a very awful situation to be in. Hello, um, this is Unbroken City Ascension, and I want to say thank you for those that are being a blessing and want to be a help. Mm-hmm helping us in our time of need. Um, Just want to briefly um, let y'all know what's been going on with us. I have been in an abusive marriage for almost 18 years, and my children had to endure um, verbal abuse from him. And he has been physically, verbally, financially, any, all type of abusive towards me. And so he had caused harm to me really bad, and and recently um, he has tried to break into the home. Um, he has broken in twice, and this last time I was fearful for my life, so I had to leave the home. So me and my children are um, are in need of help, and if you can help us in any way, we would be appreciative of any help that you can give to us as we um, trust God that he will continue to keep us and protect us and shield us from all hurt, harm, and danger. And that, um, you know, justice will be served. Also, um, you know, it's hard trying to get help out here. A lot of things are going on due to COVID and, and you know, with the signs of my family. It's been hard. I've been trying to get help. But I'm just grateful for those that... Um, that have helped me and that has been there for me. Y'all been there for me more than I can say my blood family and I'm grateful for that. Um, But I just want to share a little bit about what's going on with me and I know that one day I'll be able to really give my testimony. But I know God is moving. I already see his hands and I'm grateful for your help and being there. And thank y'all again. Thank you again, Sister Teresa. I love you, sis. And I pray everybody have a blessed day. So please, 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 let's all get her some money so she can get back on her feet. She's a wonderful woman. She loves the Lord. She's a great mom. She homeschools her children. Um, She works out of her home doing whatever she can to to make money for herself and for her family. So I don't know if he's giving her any money. I don't think he is at the, at this time. I, I have don't really know all the fine little details, but I know that she is having a major, major struggle, and I think he's probably using that to try and get her to come back. But um, she has left the home. She's found a home. So let's support her. And uh, even if, like, if this went out to 2,000 people, 3,000 people, and they each give a dollar, we've met our goal, right? So let's do this together, YouTube. (laughs) So anyways, so this is how you qualify for the giveaway. So I'm going to be doing four prizes. I'm going to be giving away 
to two people. Um, I'm going to be giving away tumblers, custom made tumblers, beautiful tumblers. I'm going to leave some pictures here somewhere. So I'm going to be giving that away to two people. And I think that those will be, those two will be in North America only because I don't know about overseas. I don't know how much it will cost. Um, I, I think I'm just going to do the tumblers, two beautiful tumblers to two, two beautiful winners um, within Canada and the U.S. And I'm going to leave pictures here. And then I'm going to do some yarn from Creative Thread. That's going to be North American as well. And then I'm going to do an Amazon gift card. Then that's going to be wor worldwide because I have people from all over the world watching my channel. So <laughs> I have to include you too. Um, but anyways, this is how you qualify to enter. First of all, I need you to like the video and comment on the video. That's not going to qualify you. That's just going to help get the, to get the, the, um, the video out into the algorithm of the YouTube algorithm. The more likes, the more comments, the more popular it is, the more people are going to end up seeing it. And that's what we want. So I need your help to like it and comment. But that doesn't enter you. <laughs> the way you enter this giveaway is you have to share the video. That's how you enter it. You can enter more than once. You can share the video on your um, on your Facebook. You can share it on your Instagram. You can share it on your Twitter. Um, and that each time you do that, that is an entry. So that it's helping to get the word out and it's helping to get you more um, entries. So every time you enter, say you enter it on Facebook, do a screenshot, email me at cravingcrochetgiveaway at gmail.com. Just do a screenshot or take a picture with your phone, whatever is easier. If you do it on Instagram, do the same thing. And just that's how you're gonna end. That's how you're gonna enter your proof that you've shared it is by sending me an email, okay? By doing Facebook, Instagram. If you have a YouTube channel and you have a community uh, tab on your on your channel, you can post it in there as well, and then just show it to me again. Screenshot it, whatever. So that's another way you can do it. Um, or you can just simply email it to a, a bunch of people that you know. If you don't have Facebook, if you don't have Instagram, if you don't have um, a YouTube channel with a community tab, you could just email it to people that you know. And then again, just send me a screenshot. I don't need to see everybody's email address. I don't want to, I'm not interested in that. I just want to be able to know that you have done this or you can forward it to me. I don't know whatever way you can think of, but emails, email is another way to enter. Okay. Now another way you can enter, <laughs> try to give you lots of options and try to get this video out so that people will see it so that people will donate. Mostly it's really for the donation that that's really touching my heart that is, um, has motivated me to do this type of a giveaway. So if you have a YouTube channel and you need content on your channel, Make a video like this one. Talk about um, domestic abuse. <laughs> that this is um, a domestic abuse um, awareness and uh, fundraising event that you want to participate in. So you tell all your subscribers about it. And then leave the link to my video below so that people can go watch mine. And... And just hopefully, I really, really hope to God that this would snowball so we can help our beautiful unbroken, unbroken Sylvia Sunshine and her family to get back on her feet. She deserves it. She's a wonderful woman of the Lord. I love her so much. She's so encouraging. Um, she's, she's an amazing, amazing woman, amazing woman. And she deserves a fresh start. And so that's why I'm doing this. And I just... Um, I just hope that you will all participate and uh, and just help me help her. And uh, remember, sharing is caring. Try to do a heart. <laughs> so let's all care. Um, give. Remember, it's better to give than it is to receive. That's what the Bible says. So it's more blessed to give than it is to receive. So, so let's put um, some kids and a beautiful mother back on track with their life and uh, 
I appreciate you watching this and just get out there, everyone, and share, 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 share. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Let me show you something.